afternoon, everyone. This is News 6 at 4, getting results. I'm Ginger Gadsden. I'm Lisa Bell. Julie is off. We begin, though, with sudden security changes at Central Florida's three biggest attractions. Starting today, SeaWorld, Universal, and Disney all announced immediate security changes. Visitors are now passing through metal detectors and undergoing random screenings. The parks say it is all about safety, but some question if there was a specific threat or something more to be concerned about. News 6 reporter Eric Sandoval is getting answers from Disney about these changes. Eric, what did you find out? Well, Disney said, among other things, that they're beefing up their own law enforcement patrols. And I cannot tell you how many Orange County Sheriff's deputies we saw going in and out of the resort today. They also say more changes are coming, some you will see and some you won't be able to see. News of the new security measures at Disney World come on the heels of the terror attacks in Paris and San Bernardino, and they're raising some concerns with some visitors. Starting this morning, metal detectors were installed at the front gates of all of Disney's theme parks where guests will be randomly screened. More law enforcement and police dogs will patrol the resort. Toy guns will no longer be allowed inside the park, and they won't be sold there either. And costumes, now only allowed on children under the age of 14 definitely speaks to the times but I, it doesn't bother me it doesn't bother me that we have to wait a little bit longer to get in somewhere because I feel safer other Orlando area parks are considering following Disney's lead Universal Orlando tells us they're experimenting with metal detectors right now and could install them soon spokesman Tom Schroeder says this test is a natural progression for us as we study best practices for security in today's world SeaWorld says it's already using wand metal detectors for its holiday event. They didn't say if they would be using them when it's over. Tourists we talked to, like Gustavo Osario, says the new measures are a double-edged sword. Yeah, it makes us feel safer, but a bit limited with the things that we can do, mm -hmm. the things that we can enjoy. Now, we asked Disney today if this was in response to any specific threat, and they gave us a blanket statement saying that they're always looking to improve their security. Now, that improvement will come tonight at the AMC Theater over at Disney Springs, where the new Star Wars movie is premiering, and metal detectors will be set up in the lobby. We're live at Walt Disney World tonight. Eric Sandoval, News 6. Back to you. Eric, thank you. And coming up at 4.30, our coverage continues from inside Disney. From alerts on the monorail to checkpoints for guests, we show you all the changes your family will see. Until then, head to clickorlando.com or facebook.com slash news6, where there is a conversation going on about these security updates. And we will have more on that reaction in 30 minutes.